I hate seeing you look so sad, honey. Sad? My heart is... But I know what I'm doing is the right thing. This is goodbye forever, Ethan. I'll never see you again. Never see your face. Look into your eyes. You belong to another woman now. I only hope she can give you the happiness that she deserves. There's an old saying, good riddance to bad. No. No, Ethan is not rubbish. I mean, he couldn't be bad even if he tried. He's the most wonderful man in the world. Didn't you just get through saying that he was just using you? He was just making a, a play for you before he got married? Yes. It's true. Honey, in my book, that is about as low as you can go. I'll never love another man the way I loved Ethan. He was perfect. And I will think of him every hour of every day for the rest of my life. Now, Teresa, even if we don't win first prize, you make a beautiful bride to be. Really? Well, I wouldn't lie. And you know what? This is a lot of fun. I'm having fun, too. <laughs> I just wish Chad and Whitney would let themselves enjoy it, too. They will if they're meant to. True love always wins out in the end. Only this time, true love didn't win. Please, God, I love Teresa. I don't know where she is, but please don't take her away from me. Teresa? She's on that plane, oh my God. That's her! She's out there on that plane pulling out. The Australia flight. Yeah, you've got to get it to turn back. Head back to the gate. I'm sorry, but that's out of the question. Look, get on the phone and call the pilot. I can't. Look, then have the tower call him and tell him to turn back. Once the plane is taxi... Look, I'm not asking you. I'm telling you. But I can't. Look, if that flight goes to Australia, I'll lose Teresa. I may never see her again. I wish I could help you. I really do. But nothing can bring that plane back now. Forget about him, honey. He's not worth it. No man is. You pay that jerk back for what he did to you. Email those documents. That'll really get him where he lives. I can't do it. I love him. I can only hope that I never see him again. Ladies and gentlemen, the tower informs me there'll be a brief delay, but we will be taking off very shortly. I mean, they won't cancel the flight, will they? No, oh, it's just the way things are these days. Flights, flights get delayed. Although, I don't know. This is something new. It looks like we're taking on another passenger. And it's got to be somebody important, because I have never seen a plane stop to take on somebody after it's left the gate. Teresa? Look, I know you're on this plane. Where are you? Teresa, I know that's you under the blanket. Go away. 
No, Teresa, I can't do that. Get your stuff and come with me. Are you hard of hearing? She said go away. Leave the girl alone. Yeah, and get off the flight. You're gonna make us late for our connection. You're gonna have to get off this airplane, sir. Now, I don't care who you are. The tower tells us we can take off now. You're gonna have to exit immediately. Teresa, if you don't get off this plane, if you go to Australia, we might never see each other again. Don't do this to me, Ethan, please. It's you, Teresa. You're doing this to me. Leave her alone. Stand by your man, honey. I really must insist you get off this plane. Look, Teresa, you have to get off this plane. You've got to. Please, there is so much I have to tell you. Don't go, sweetie. You made a decision. You stick to it. 